almost tripped over my camera that was on the floor. So Adam was in the middle of taking the cereal out of the box and he accomplished and what he set out to do. Took the box and, and poured most of it out. I'm on my way to the store. I'm going to take you guys with me because I need to buy some stuff for the house for the typhoon. I did clean up my fridge. Let me show you guys uh, some oranges because the kids love the oranges. Ask me why the oranges are green. Um, some are orange, some are green, but they taste the same. Kids, I thought they wanted watermelon, but they didn't even ask for it yet. So it may last for two days. And then I purchased some hamburger meat. So. Yep, so Jordan did some art this morning. She cut out baby Moses. It's supposed to be in the baby basket right here, but we didn't get there. <laughs> so I was reading through you guys' comments, and I want to answer a couple of them right now on this vlog. Okay, a lot of people were telling us to use candles and flashlights, of course. If there's a typhoon, that's what we did. We just need to go out and buy more. And a lot of the supplies are already gone. There was over 2,000 people without power. Yes, my husband was enjoying the power outage. I told him if he was not here, that I would probably cry. I had to have power. <laughs> I, I probably would do that like luckily my husband's here to uplift us you know like when you have all these things lightly like on the iPad but we lost power for three days so we had to take the kids outside multiple times not saying that we don't take them out like I take them to the park you know maybe on the weekend or anything like that like because we don't have a park close to our house anymore but not that close to our house anymore so we took them outside just to run them like even if it was just even if it was just for like 20 to 30 minutes they were happy and good and tired and we did that routine right right at, right before bedtime here 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 banana okay you don't want the banana all right guys so we're about to go to the store if, all right but anyway um so we're we're good there's another typhoon T coming I think tomorrow or tonight or something like that so yes I am out of work today because the daycare is closed but my husband's at work because you know we both don't need to stay home with the kids only one of us everybody else is at work the teachers are all there working but I get to stay home as well as anyone else that has a small baby in daycare so my work is awesome and then tomorrow is also no school because that's when the winds are supposed to be the strongest and Monday is no school either because of the holiday Columbus Day. So whatever, three days, five days off, feels like a vacation. So now it's time to go oh yeah, to guys, school. I wanted to show you our couch before we go. I don't know if I showed it on the vlog yet, but I really like this cool Japanese couch. It has really tiny pillows, <laughs> like literally. I wish I could compare them to the other pillows, but we didn't take a move. So like you can pick it up, take it off if you don't want them on there. There's two of them. I think I can move it over here too. You can use it as like an armrest over there. A little like ottoman. Adam just had a banana right here so I had to wipe it off. You know, kid life. But it can be moved like on this side to make it a... And it's super light too. That's the thing I like about it. Like I'm literally moving this with my foot. So, yeah. So I can look just like that. Or you can take that ottoman move it over there make that side longer or we can put it in the middle of the carpet so yes love it you guys I did not take you guys in the store because the rain just started coming down me and Jordan were all in Adam we're all soaked we came here to get groceries I'll probably do a grocery haul in the next video and show you guys what we got for this typhoon but Whew. I cannot take you guys inside the store because there are so many people inside the store. All the batteries are sold out, okay? So, no, I'm, it looks like I took a shower. I'm soaked. She's soaking wet right now. Look at her face. Oh my gosh. How did that feel? Did it feel like a shower? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. And then Adam's right here. He's soaked. He was screaming. Yeah, but a lot of you guys said you've been through hurricanes and you're used to having all this wind and rain and whatever. Like, but usually when we get typhoons, it's not this bad. And usually I'm not out shopping in it. So since we have a gas stove, I'm gonna go home, cook all the food. It's gonna be like a meal prep. I got like three different types of meats. I will do a separate video for a grocery. I tried to find Adam a costume 
so that we can start our vlogtober video but that was unsuccessful he did not want to try on the costume in the store so what we're going to do is we're going to do a makeshift one just for the intro of this video and then later on you guys will see what the kids are going to be for joy night or halloween or whatever we don't really celebrate halloween um, we celebrate it with our church and we call it joy night because you know we don't want anything scary or anything like that I am supposed to be going to go buy a rice cooker. I don't know if that's gonna happen because I'm soaked, okay? Um, but let me go ahead and hurry up and get home, put the groceries away, and then I'll decide if I wanna go back out. Comment below, let me know what you wanna see. Like, do you wanna see more of the damage of the typhoon in Japan? Because there, there's, there was a lot of damages that I didn't even put in my video. A lot of pictures floating around on Facebook from different areas. Uh, when we regained our power back after three days of no power, no cell phone service, like I couldn't even call my mom, nothing. Like everything was down. I could barely check my Facebook. We had to drive to different parts of our town uh, just to get cell phone service like we had to go to the cell phone company and Josh got a new phone and then while we were there they have like um, they have they have internet so we were able to update our Facebook and our family any communication whatsoever was really scary like my mom she didn't she said she tried to call me and she was like I couldn't get through and even us we tried to call our uh, Joshua's dad Papa, and they lived like right up the road and it was like beep 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 so it was like no communication we we had to literally go to their house in our car three times to let them know what we we're doing like hey we're going to the store do you need anything okay no um so that's what i'm saying like it was crazy and a week has been typhoon 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 so i'm just ready for it to be over i'm really hoping that we don't lose any electricity this time um What did you get? Did you get stacking toys? Yeah, guys, so he's really into stacking now, so hopefully the new toy will help out during the typhoon. Prep some food for our family. So I'm gonna let Josh say hi to you guys, and then we're gonna end the vlog right here. Just got home, about to drink the coffee, because I'm actually tired. Charging all of our appliances. Huh? Oh, what'd you get? What'd you do? Took charging all the devices? Charging all the devices, do my phone <laughs> first, then my iPad. So I can have something to draw with tonight. Yes. I bought uh, batteries, I don't think they're the right size. Because they, they were out of like the biggest battery. Okay, so we need AAA for the triple A. small flashlight. I bought and AAA. And then the huge batteries for the, big, for the big flashlight. But I don't think we have the huge batteries. Okay, so no, all we, we got have this. One small tiny flashlight. And we got our cell phones. So. We're going to get ready for this typhoon. Kids are here. Yeah. I got off work early because we went to TC1C. Oh no. But uh, we're in TC1. I'm gonna play a game of basketball and relax it out. While you have electricity. While I have a chance, I'm gonna soak up all this electricity. <laughs> Here we go. Thank you. 
Alright guys, it's the end of the video and now it's time for us to do our post notification <laughs> shout out. Uh, Josh is going to pick a random person. Anita Ford. Thank you Anita Ford for subscribing to our channel and leaving us a comment down below. If you guys would like to be featured in our post notification shout out, all you have to do is comment right down below and we'll pick a random person in the next video. Yes we will. Alright guys. Mm -hmm.